The 80 year old Dennis Jerkowitz walks the Binney estate, once home to the inventor of the Crayola crayon, Edwin Binney. I've owned it for about 20 years, and we love the fact that it's still rural and it's still beautiful with all the wildlife and all the vegetation, the natural things. But a proposed development called Indrio Woods would use land that surrounds the property. We're right here. This is five acres. This is 33 acres that WGI is going to put seven apartment buildings with one exit. A more than 200 unit apartment project is proposed near Indrio and Taylor Dairy Roads. After facing opposition in March, the developer is now back with changes based on the feedback. Tonight the board will be hearing that revised plan which will be reducing the density, you know, the number of units. It will also be increasing the open space. Um, the developer will be providing some additional funding for uh, road improvements and changing the traffic patterns. The revised plan has 45 fewer units and eliminates parking spaces to allow for more green space. In a statement, WGI, the engineering firm representing the developer, says in part, St. Lucie County is in need of varied housing types, particularly for essential workforce housing like our firefighters, police, and teachers. The project, which is close to the airport and a planned fire station, helps to fill that need. It also meets the requests of the community and the county commission. Cassandra Garcia, WPTV, News Channel 5.